Hey there, everyone. This is Al Cowbling Mega Man Legends, the second one. And last time we got here, and uh, Teasel was causing problems, and then so I got involved, and then problems stopped. I don't know where I'm going exactly. Like, I know that Tron and Bon are in the actual key zone right now. I don't know where I am or how to get there. Alright, see, so look at that. They're rebuilding already. Looking great. I have some amount of money. Oh, wait a second. Well, wait a second. Okay, I can't afford an extra pack. I do will have to recharge it, so I'm just gonna go ahead and ask that. Yeah, uh, yeah I'll, I'll take it. Always be full of money. Well, yeah, but more- Whoa! Sorry, I'm getting all my buns mixed up. Do you have anything I want more that I can afford? Like, everything is really expensive. I don't really need these. And, uh, I am not interested in any of these, so... Well, Upgrade Pack is not... bad. Plus one to everything? Link Armor? Huh. Okay. Alright. That looks pretty good, actually. Oh, Link like in Chain Link. Like, okay, I get it. I understand what you're saying. They're really hot, so be careful you don't get burned. It's gonna be a fire dungeon, which makes an amount of sense. Are we seriously just going straight to the dungeon, though? Like, that's my question. What's that over here? It's like a fox? A raccoon? It's a little raccoon! Okay, and then he made a not joke. It's pretty good. Yeah, so I'm exploring town after the war zone. Uh, that is my current activity. I don't know where I am. Hey, no problem. But yeah, like, before we got to the second dungeon, like, it was a huge to do with the whole. Well, this is gonna leave me outside, isn't it? With, you know, we had to fight Glide like five times and all his bird folk and all that, but, um, okay. I guess, yeah, that's the entrance. But, um, here, maybe we're just gonna go straight up. Alright, so... I don't really understand how this is built, but that's okay with me. I don't have access to guns here. Like, so, okay, so about the boss yesterday, you know, it was suggested in the comments that perhaps... What? Is everything already being... Okay, no, it's because I'm used to seeing it from the other side, the other angle, I see. Is, uh... Okay, fair enough. They don't want to model uh, in repair part of that part. I get that. You don't have to press the issue. It's fine. Uh, but yeah, so like, you know, if, if using the bazooka would have made more sense than what I did, which was jumping and using normal attacks, but you know, my bazooka has a thing where it cannot be used while in motion. Is jumping being in motion? Like, that's the question. Well, we're right here, so I haven't done anything useful. Yeah, let's go into rooms. Let's just go there directly. Let's just... We're not we're not skipping any beats here. It's just... So we're these are the skipping all rooms. the beats, actually. We're going there directly. Something really big near you. Sounds you're great. Right. To my it's right, huh? Giant oh, well, you're being interrupted. And the spiky boys are afraid. Was that a reaver ball? It's, what a, happened? it's a spiky Why boy. Did it run off like that? I don't know. Maybe there's something over there. Maybe. You should go take a look, Mega Man. What about this where there's a big robot? <laughs> Tell me there's a big robot somewhere. I want in. I want in on that big robot action. Oh, is that a dancer? Oh jeez. Oh, you're fun. And you take a lot of shots. Look at that. Just swipe a saurus is going like this. I'm a spooky ghost. <laughs> okay, uh, my ability to aim where I want to is being very helpful here, I must say. All right, just let's create ex Well, you're barely doing any damage, though. You're just, like, really annoying. Like, look at my health, how not it's going down. Like, you're big, you take up space, you knock me around, but you barely do any damage. So, all right. There's another side passage. But should I... Okay. Here's more side passages. I'm gonna go see this with its logical end. But I think I'm gonna go back and go back to a... Uh, no, that's a, an elevator. 
Yeah, I want to go back and go where the spiky tomato boys went because like I'm pretty sure the game had a reason to go Whoa, what's going on there? Like the game wants me to see there So let's play along. Let's be nice Check it out real quick Um and I guess I'm learning that there's a locked door that I can't enter. Probably needs a red key of some kind. Wait, what? Looks like a key is needed. Yeah, so... CONFIRMED! I feel like Roll's trailblazing job is very good. It's just like, hey, what's over there? And then I check it out and there's... Wait, that's not a door? I'm trying to door you, friend. Okay, I'm not able to uh, interact with that. So these are not doors. Like even on the map, there's like a little recession. Maybe something's gonna, I'm gonna activate something in a dungeon and that's gonna make them do something. It's possible. This looks like a door on the map though. You're like I'm right there. I'm right about being right there. Oh, hey, a little, uh, little twisty zone. All right, big empty room with Nothing. Can I interact with this? Button pad. No, okay. I can step on these all I want. Doesn't seem to do all that much. Alright. The music is being very menacing, by the way. Alright, there's a computer! I'm gonna compute it. Oh, okay. So the elevator I saw wouldn't have worked. Man, I'm just... <laughs> I'm just not interacting with things. I can't interact. Whoa. But that's summon for- oh, that's summon for some baddies. Alright, yeah, that's right, we're gonna fight. So there's one in the middle that I kind of ignored, because my auto-aim decided that the one there on the pedestal was more important. And that's- that's the law, right? This game is the game of where you struggle with your stupid auto-aim that barely works. Wow, that was a good move, though. Yeah, look at that, just big explosion. There's health just everywhere. It's kind of gross. It's too much health, honestly. It makes me uncomfortable. Alright, well, I am just... Yeah. Oh, you can just sit on these and you're safe. Hey, I did it. Together, we have persevered. So those platforms are still just little platforms, as you would expect. Now we're on a run on this twisty pathway. Then we're gonna go up to a thing that would open up, but I wanted to go in the door anyway. Here we are, another hallway. That's right, rhyming way with way. I got away with words. Oh, that's the big boy you were seeing. These are windows. Oh. <laughs> oh, but you're not allowed to just like aim. Auto aim is at center mass. I wanted to shoot at the head, but auto aim had other ideas. All right, so those are windows. Good to know. It's not all. Hey, explosion, buddy! You are a universal constant of the universe, and uh, I'm glad to. See, uh, you are also a universal constant of the universe, and I wish you weren't. You're you're terrible to fight. I'm just gonna do that all day long. Ooh, I wonder if my bazooka would, like, knock it out. I mean, I don't need to experiment with that immediately, but I can with you. I mean, that didn't, like, knock you over or anything, but it did do a lot of damage. So that's good to know. Alright, here's another elevator. Have you ever seen an elevator? It's a little podium that sticks out from the ground. Then you press a button, and then you go out of town. There's a thing- oh, that's my monkey. Sorry for shooting you, monkey, but my auto-aim found you, and I was like, alright, well, I'm gonna shoot that thing, it's moving. So, mid-dungeon monkey? A concept that can exist? Surely you jest. <laughs> I'm being- I'm being weirdly sarcastic here. But, look, I really could have used your help back in the water dungeon, money. Money? Monkey. But I forgot the K. Ooh, red room! Everything is wavy a little bit, it's warm. Hey, it's the- yeah, it's that. It's what we've been seeing. Then I wanted to shoot at the head, but I couldn't. Big T-Rex looking thing. It's huge! Hi! Okay, it's- yeah, hammer! Got it. Hammerhead Thesaurus. Fox. Rip. 
and then it's in the dark and you can't see it good even though it's huge. That's a giant bot I on my yeah. Oh, why am I on fire? I'm on fire right now and I'm having a bad time. Oh yeah, some of the floors are red. Yeah, you probably want to not go there. By the way, Roll is saying things, I have no idea what, because this is pretty loud, and she did not have like any text bubble. Okay, 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 okay. Well, I mean, that's fine. It's kind of funny that the, the space you came from pointed at data. Can I skip this? I can. Yeah, so... Bad floors on the side. You kinda have to, yeah, be careful about that. The shockwave there did damage. Yes, there is. I'm right in it. I mean, that would be good. She's talking about anti-lava shoes right now. But I'm feeling confident about this. Maybe I shouldn't, but I am. Yeah, so the issue is the... I mean, look, I'm going to go ahead and drink my canteen. Like, I have that for a reason. Here we go. Being on fire is not a lot of fun, but, you know, it happens. Alright, you're on all four now. Uh, can I just go underneath and shoot you in the chin? Sure looks like it. Alright, do you like that? Like, okay, you're drinking... Yeah. Okay. How can we stop the feeling? Well, I need to stop it from drinking the lava, looks like. Alright, so... Uh, is there anything else going on in this room? I don't know. I'm exploring the room. Oh! Well, well, well! There's a door behind it all. Okay, maybe we can drain the lava. Okay, that was not meant to be like the fight. Wait a minute! Uh -huh. There's something funny about that door. Is there? I think you should take a look at it. Okay. Well, let me look at something. Yeah, so big massive room. But yeah, so there's a door at the other end. I feel like I should almost restart and not use up my canteen that way. No, no, no. We'll play that honest. <laughs> what? <laughs> What's that? That was silly. Yeah, that door is green on the map. What does that mean? All right. So is that what Roll wanted to talk to me about? That's a locked door. It's a door that is locked. Good, thank you for the info. Oh, here we're doing platforming over lava, potentially. Okay. Mighty leap! Yeah, yeah, yeah. Here we go. We're platforming tonight. So there's a door there, and there's a door here. I'm taking the here. Alright, like, I mean, I have to make decisions. There's two locks I need to find for that green door, after all. So, we're gonna look for that. Um... Alright, I don't know what- Whoa! Mr. Sandworm in the lava popping up. Alright, you know, having a good time. Oh, there we go. It's throwing little, like, orbs of lightning. And locking me down like that is very rude. So, my Oda lock, while they're sunk in, does not know where they are, which can be a problem. I, I don't know if I'm gonna gain anything from destroying them. Just feels like a. Like, I don't know if there's even like a finite amount of them. Oh, shoot. No, no, no. Mm. Alright, let's finish my canteen, I guess. It's not great, but next time, if I do, whoops, didn't do that. If I do get a game over, like, I'm going to, yeah, like, is there a finite amount of these? Am I wasting my time? I guess there's one way to find out. If I go here, it does open. All right, sounds great. Yeah. Okay, that's great. It looks like great. a lock was released somewhere. Yeah. Do you know which door might have opened? Not really. The map you downloaded from Ooh. the control panel should also show you the locked doors. Why don't you take a look at it? Yep, that's... Oh, that's a good point. Okay, so maps. 
So we should be able to see what's locked or not. So there's something there. That's still green, so it's still locked. That's what that means. There's another door here, which leads to a lot, it looks like. I have barely touched anything. That's the lesson I'm getting. So I can't go there, but I can go there or there. Here is a huge thing that leads to a dot, and here is a huge thing that leads to a dot. So I'm thinking those are what I want to interact with. Oh, now we got new buddies here. Whoa, boy. Okay. Big flower worms with giant fireball breath. As you do. Oh, jeez. Okay, your fire just kind of separated itself from your, uh, your middle part. That's wacky. And I'm almost dead. Uh, I think that the rational thing to do at this point would be to go back to data and save. But now we got buddies everywhere, so survival isn't even that guaranteed. Yeah, 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 so, okay. So here's the thing, though. If I opt to save, I'm losing all my healing. Because I used up all my healing options, right? Well, too bad, maybe. Or is this too bad? Where am I? Am I? Okay. So, oh, shoot. Really? That killed me? Is there a tell that it's even there? Oh, boy. Okay. That's the giant reaver bot I spotted on my scope before. Yeah, you did. It's different from the other reaver bots we've encountered. Now I know so that it's not really a fight, so I'm not using up any healing at all. Like, technically, this is better for me. Let's be real. Alright, but I gotta recreate, so this is what I'm trying There's to open. something funny about that door. I think you should take a look at it. Like, can you see anything that, that would indicate that there's a trap here? I'm not. <laughs> Alright, if I don't waste my time on the... Um, on the fireworms here, though, like, I'm going to be, like, a lot safer. Like, and it's going to go a lot faster. Right over here. Yeah, there's enemies in the water, lava, that's fine. Forget about it. You can't do anything about them. Well, I think you can do something about them. It's just that it they're, uh... Like the lock was they're do you know More importantly, it's just that I think they just keep coming back. The map you downloaded from the control panel I still think that what I should do, I think, because I know that these things are huge, I'm thinking that the right decision is to go to the monkey save and then resume tomorrow like go on the two switch trek to gain uh, access to the green door over here all right i got paralyzed somehow that's a lot of fun because that's the status where you just kind of sit there Pretty good. Like, there's not really anything to do, but to, yeah, you just kind of chill and set. Chit set. Here we go! We're chilling and we're sitting! And then you don't. Hey, flower. You're gone now. And I'm stunned again. It's pretty good. Where is that door that I know is here, by the way? Like, if I look at a map. I thought there was another door, another, like, downward passage. Is there not? Did I just get mixed up? Oh, it's here in the dragon zone. So, yeah, I need to return there anyway, so, yeah. Don't feel bad. Got it! Not feeling bad. Well, I'm feeling bad because of the electricity that's surrounding me. Hey, flower. It's a fire flower. Did it. Figure it out. All right, so yeah, we'll be returning here. We're returning to the this, this, this Norb trap that what? <laughs> a Norb trap that what? <sighs> All right, back to the Dino King room, which has two fun doors. And, uh, 
We will be going on those fun doors, don't worry about it. And also, looking at the map, there's another, like, passage here that is unlocked. So, this is something I gotta do. And... Uh, this is something I gotta do. Alright, so there's a lot I gotta do, actually. So there's two pathways. Those are both from the Dragon Room, actually. Interesting. I somehow didn't really know. I love having the map open, because now I don't feel the need to, like, go into every single little corner. That's a big old QOL, as they, as they say. But yeah, today was, like, our intro to the concepts of the Dragon Cave. Next time, uh, we will be delving for real. I mean, like I said, I, I know the water dungeon taught me these things can get pretty big. And you get a monkey here at a sensible space. Like, I'm, I'm gonna take it. Just wanna just look at something, though. So this is where we come from. And it doesn't look like we missed anything. And this is where, like, this is where it starts. And this is what ultimately we want to open, which is going to lead to this. Okay, which is its own big thing that leads to something. Alright, so, yeah. This does feel like about maybe halfway, a third of the way through. Taking the water dungeon sort of as a... As a model here. 